Yo guys, what's up? How's it going? So today I'm looking at GoEV, ticker symbol G-O-E-V. The actually company's name is Canoe. So a lot of people just call it GoEV, but their real name is Canoe. And they make really cool EVs. Uh, so their lifestyle vehicle is really pretty cool. Um, disclaimer up front, I do have a pre-order in for one of their lifestyle vehicles because it's so awesome. I really like the concept of it. They have other things like pickup trucks, cargo vans, um, other stuff like that. They have a kind of a mobile platform uh, that they use, skateboard technology. Uh, go check that out. Go check out my other video, a little more in-depth technical um, and what they do and how they do things. Um, but as far as the technical indicators go, they look positive. Uh, they've got a green one here on the moving average, a green here on the MACD, and a green on the stochastic. So its stock is going to pretty much move higher this next week unless there's some negative news. Um, so I really like the stock. It got really beat down for some really unknown reason. I mean, they had some bad earnings. I mean, but they were not really selling any cars yet, so that's to be expected. So they were down at five bucks, and I bought a couple put uh, long-term leaps in that company. Um, I think I sold a put or two. And uh, I, I'm really bullish on this for the long term. I mean, it's not the next Tesla, per se, but I think they really have a good market niche uh, carved out for them. Um, I think they have a great concept, and I think they're going to make some great cars as long as they can get the manufacturing off the ground. That's where a lot of these car companies are going to have an issue, like like uh, Lordstown Auto Ride, right? They're having issues going from design into the manufacturing phase and even Tesla today um, says they're in manufacturing uh, upscaling hell right so production hell whatever they says uh, sorry for the the language but that's it's a direct quote and we'll see how things go for these guys I don't anticipate them having issues or have a little bit smaller scale than Tesla does they're a little bit more of a niche product and they're not a direct competitor for sure, in, in some areas. They might be. Uh, it's hard to say with their trucks. Uh, the Cyber Truck is pretty cool, but uh, these guys have a pretty cool truck too. Uh, a little different scale, uh, definitely different look um, altogether. So check, go check these guys out. Let me know what you think. Uh, I like their products. Um, so far, I've not actually seen them in person yet, but I can't wait to see them soon. Uh, hopefully, they'll be rolling out and uh, I'll be getting one in my driveway at some point. And we'll see how things go. Alright guys, tell me what you guys think of ChargePoint. I'm probably going to sell some puts this week. And maybe buy some leaps. See how things go. Alright guys, be sure to subscribe to my channel. And thanks for watching.